some cool uh, libraries in Polk County. Well, the Polk Museum of Art has a really nice library. This is the Polk County Historical and Genealogical Library in Bartow. There's also the Law Library in Bartow. Watson Clinic as a library. Um, let's not forget our academic libraries. Florida Southern College and the McKay Archive Center, Southeastern University, Polk State College, and USF Polytechnic. Uh, all are open to community users. You can come in and use our resources. And with certain circumstances, you can even check out the books. Um, don't forget your kids, school libraries. Parents can go sometimes and check out the, the books. And this is really cool. This is a Florida electronic library. This is free for every Florida resident. Uh, it's from the state. Academic information, scientific uh, journals, newspapers, readers' advisories, teachers' resources, digital archives like the Florida Memory Project. It's a great resource. Uh, the professional ethical commitment of ALA says that no one should be denied information because he or she cannot afford the cost of a book or periodical, have access to the internet or information in any of its various formats. That's what your libraries do for society, they work for the common good. <laughs> so are libraries cupcake or a waste of money? Well, cupcakes can make you fat, but the internet can make you lazy and dumb. Libraries make good citizens. Libraries deserve our never-ending love, not just fashionable infatuation. The library is not dead, far from it, and it is evolving. As Walter Cronkite once said, whatever the cost of our libraries, the price is cheap compared to that of our ignorant nation. Obey, ignorant nation. So please, if you love your library, if you find it useful, please support it, and please make sure your elected representative know as well.